first thing we need to think about is our Christmas lights. Now, I'm sure they don't look like this and they're all nice and tidy, but you know, this is all technology now and um, not really something we should be using these days. So let's get rid of that and try going for something a bit more safer in terms of LED lights. Um, there's still some issues to think about in terms of where you plug them in and we'll look at those now. So this is our standard four gang extension we would call this. It doesn't have a grommet at the end on either end of the cables and uh, it's not switchable so whatever you plug in is permanently on. So what we're really looking for is a switchable extension block. Now this does have a grommet into the unit and that stops it kinking sharp and breaking but also you can turn on and turn off what you do and don't want. To support that though, what we're looking at is a RCD protector. Now this goes straight into the socket in the wall and then you plug the extension block into that. What this does is it picks up any drops in voltage very early on. So if you've got a fault, this will detect it in 0.3 of a second and at that it'll kill the power. So one useful option for you, uh, especially if you've got the Christmas tree plugged into the wall and you can't actually get to the plugs anymore. So how about using a remote control adapter? Now here you plug the Christmas tree lights into the adapter and you use the handset to simply turn on or turn off that plug. So that kills the power and therefore turns it all off, makes it nice and safe at the end of the night. Another option for you is a timed adapter. I'm sure you've seen the old type where you manually set it. Well this is digital, has a little readout at the top so we can put in when we want the lights to come on and when we want them to go off. Another form of extension, well we've all got these, is the drum extension. Now quite useful, but bear in mind when you use this, you must pull the cable out to its full extent. Now that's gonna pose a bit of a trip hazard, so be careful where you're going to use it. In addition, if you are gonna use the drum, you need an RCD adapter. Now this plugs into the socket in the wall and then the plug into the adapter then if there is a problem with the cable or the Christmas lights, the adapter will kill the power in 0.3 of a second. It's just a case then of unplugging it, resetting it and finding out what the problem is with the extension in the first place.